What's going guys, it's Deathmog here. Today we're going to be talking about some rather interesting information concerning Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Now, it has been a little bit quiet in terms of any news that we may have gotten over the past few weeks regarding Black Ops 6 at the moment. Um, it's just either that, either they're not allowed to do it, or not allowed to announce anything due to the embargo, or it could be something different. Or it could just potentially be the case that there's actually nothing to report about. But apparently over the last 24 hours or so, courtesy of Bob Network UK, who's a well-known uh, data miner for Call of Duty, apparently it's been brought to my attention that Unlimited Tech Sprint will become a perk when Black Ops 6 integrates with Warzone in Season 1. Now this is going to be more or less in the um, maybe October, November, very early December time frame. So, very, very interesting there, guys. Uh, let me know what you guys' views and opinions are of this in the comments box down below. Of course, tech sprint boots, if I'm not mistaken, I think they're in Warzone at the moment. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think it might be inside of... Um, I can't remember if it's in Urzikstan or if it's on Rebirth Island, but I'm pretty sure I've seen it on Rebirth Island back on the, um, the submarine. So, I, I think it has been known to spawn there, so that is really interesting. Again, let me know your guys' reason thoughts of that. Uh, apparently, the backpack that we've had since Warzone 2's inception will finally disappear when Black Ops 6 integrates with Warzone, and will be returned to the system last seen in OG Warzone back in the days of uh, Modern Warfare 2019. So, but we'll have to wait and see how everyone feels about that. Um, apparently, somebody has actually responded to this rather interesting user. Meaning that the ammo will be capped off? I don't know about that. Because the way we have it now, basically making it to where we can go beyond the max ammo count, it was way better than how it was in Warzone 1. Unless they actually keep it that, then that'd be fine. If not, then yeah, I don't know. He says, only thing I use those five slots for is armor plates. Armor be for real. So, extra plates and ammo is the only thing that made the new system better. So if those packs are staying, I'm chill. I can do with that holding more smoke, scotch streaks, and self revives. So, let me know what you guys' views and opinions are of that in the comments. Apparently, also wild cards will feature in Warzone when Black Ops 6 integrates. Eight attachments on a weapon is one of the many wild cards that will be available. So, that is really interesting as well. Uh, of course, we've got uh, eight star weapons in Warzone at the moment. So, let me know what you guys' views and opinions are of that in the comments box down below. So, but we'll have to really see how Warzone uh, will work in. Black Ops 6's time frame, so let me know what you guys' views and opinions are of this in the comments box down below, keen to hear what you guys' views and opinions are. Uh, if anything else gets reported about Black Ops 6 or the upcoming version of Warzone, I'll let you guys know, make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel. I think I've pretty much covered everything so far that we know of at this present moment in time, but if you, if you spot anything else, leave your thoughts in the comments, and I'll keep you guys updated here on the channel. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so don't upload, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, peace out.